Follow me, Master. I shall guide you to the location. A guide is most welcome. Now we shan't lose our way. That's it. I've had enough. Clear off. And don't come back till you're ready to do business properly. But I've got the coin. I swear it. I simply just... Where is it then, eh? Bring the coin, all of it, or I'll call the sentinels on you again. Are we clear? Hmm? Oh, tis you. You're... Thank you again, sir. You don't know how grateful I am to you. Well met, sir. Forgive my presumption, but were you the one who gave my granddaughter that medicine in Melv? I thought so. <laughs> She's not stopped talking of her adventure since she arrived home. You have my sincerest thanks for aiding her. That girl's always running off on some fool's errand or other. For all my chiding. Once she gets an idea under her bonnet, there's simply no talking her out of it. Now listen. Tisn't much, but I'd fain offer you a discount on my wares. Pray, make good use of it, won't you? Welcome and well met. Don't think I've forgotten your discount now. I'll knock a few gold pieces off or to you buy. So spend away, my good sir. Do come again. Well, it takes two to make a sale. And this cellar had nothing to tempt us. Oh, tis you. You're a welcome sight. Forgive my boldness, but I've a small favor to ask of you. Would you be willing to lend me some gold? I swear you'll be repaid in full. Are you sure? Oh, many thanks. I shall repay you anon, you've my word. Not you again. I thought I made myself quite clear. Ah, but I've brought the gold this time. I assume that changes things. Oh, well, I. If you've got the gold, then you're welcome to spend it. This is the one you've been eyeing, isn't it? Go on then, take it. My thanks. I finally have what I came for, and worry not, you'll have your coin back in good time, I promise you. He seems a young man of decent character. I believe his promise to repay you was a genuine one. This might be worth a read. Shall we take a closer look? I've just recalled a little tidbit I heard from the locals. If you refer to changes in the military's makeup, I've heard this. Same. Your Majesty, your timing is impeccable. I just thought to call for you. Tis not a matter for prying ears. Pray, let us speak out here. As I informed you when last we spoke, the palace is filled with the Queen Regent's sycophants. Should Deesa denounce your majesty as a false arisen, few would elect to doubt her. Yet if we are to prove your identity, I believe there is no occasion more suitable than the coronation. It was delayed so that the sovereign, that is, the false arisen, could convalesce in the palace, but the date has now been set. The central players in the court ought all be in attendance. It would be a fine opportunity to display your majesty's power. 
None would be able to deny that you are the true Arisen, then. There is a problem, however. Entry to such an event is limited to the chosen few. Only select members of the nobility and citizens who have contributed greatly to Vermont's continued prosperity will be granted entry. If your majesty is to be counted among them, you will need to attend to a number of tasks. Pray, allow me to summarize them for you. The citizenry have called upon my soldiers to cull monsters that plague the land. I dare say, it would be a fine contribution were you to accomplish these tasks unaided. What say you? Might I ask for your cooperation in this matter? I thank you, your majesty. There are three locales that I've seen significant trouble of late. The first is Trevo Mine, to the northwest. We've had reports of goblins swarming in great numbers. Next is Half Village, west of Burnworth. I believe soldiers have already been dispatched to call an infestation of Saurians there. Finally, there is a call for someone to locate a group of soldiers tasked with delivering freight. They were last seen crossing the second bridge on the eastern edge of Vermin. We have been charged with the felling of monsters. By combining our strengths, we shall overcome this trial as all others. Trevor Mine is but a stone's throw from here. Pray, allow me to show you the way. Come, I'll lead the way. I fear I must stray from the thread of our conversation to tell you. Oft do we call on you to carry the burdens we cannot. I must thank you. Your toil keeps me light on my feet. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. No harm in picking a few. Goblins, master! Shame I've no advantage against this foe. Are we all in the same boat? One of us has been drenched. Good work. Think nothing of it. Not a bad idea. I grant you roaring flame. Well done, Master! <laughs> the creature's corpse will serve us well. You cut quite the hunter's figure.
grant you an elemental boon. Destroy us only enhances our chances against future adversaries. Look, Master, a treasure chest. We shall have to find a way to reach it. Over here, if you would. Look upon this sky for all eternity if it wasn't for the crick in my neck. Keep gazing upward, and you're like to stumble ere long. That wasn't a homecoming, I envision. Yeah, more than my life's worth it. Now there's a hassle I could do without. What to make of this? Have we purchased all that we require? We ought to review the contents of our packs just to be sure. Well, that would Mayhap you'll think this a trifle, but... Curious thing. One of my former masters chose to hire only women. I wonder why. Each to their own. Trevo Mine is but a stone's throw from here.
Tis about time we pressed on, wouldn't you say, Master? Hold fast, Arisen! I will be with you in but a moment! I'll wager I could make that shot. Go right ahead. It's a glad thing to be rested when we do. We must not let down our guard. the elements. The monsters left us a parting gift. I'll see it safely into my pack, don't you worry. This is generally used as a material. I'm sure we'll... find a purpose for it in due time. I've just remembered. There was another matter we were to attend to hereabouts. Was there not? Efficiency is not the only factor worth in consideration. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. Shall we see if there's aught to be found while we're here? I will heal you with my magics. Wait a moment.
Efficiency at its best. Once more. Pray, follow me. We've arrived, just as planned. A cave. Shall we proceed into the depths? Tread carefully. One never can be too cautious. It is easily done. I'll combine my magic with yours. Trounced our foe well and true. He's got goblins! Forgive me, but I cannot guide you from here. Nought feels quite so wasteful. Uh, coming upon a fine piece of equipment after purchasing the very same item. Let my magic grant you an elemental boon. I knew that I could count upon your strength arisen. to find out what's inside. Seal themselves here. 
keep your certainly arisen. How might I be available? Now there's a worthy pro- Oi, you then. If you're fit to fight, give us a hand. Right, lend us your aid. Scatter the goblins! It is done. I like that. You've a strong arm. It was a simple patrol mission. Till we walked into their ambush, those cursed things caught us entirely unawares. I don't know where we'd be if you hadn't come along. I pray you'll let me repay the favour, if ever there's a chance. Over here, if you please. Avoided? Tis fight or die. Fear not, tis well in hand. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. No harm in picking a few. Over here, if you would. Danger might lurk anywhere. Wear every shadow and mind the sea. Lord can threaten us if we watch each other's backs. We 
need this report back. This calls for a curative. Follow me, Master. Our next task awaits. Shall I lead you to the location nearest here, Arisen? We were to make for Harv Village, as I recall. It is not far from here. Over here, if you please. Over here, Master. Did you lose sight of your like to grow over and if you keep picking up every little trinket you find? Really coming down. Take heart. The worst it can do is drench our equipment. I'll carefully conserve my strength and endeavor to survive every battle. Why are you doing this, Arisen? I shall do as you say. I'll gather these now. It would be a shame to forget their location when we need them most. Come, I'll lead the way. Your strength arisen! I grant you fire blade! Use it back! Much obliged. Here you are. Tis a reward well earned.
Over here, if you would. What is that? A tower? Nay, a statue? We ought to take a closer look. Over here, if you please. Here we are. Oh, you've come to a dangerous place. Scaly beasts make this their den. We've been dispatched to cull them. A small force ventured inside, though I've seen neither hide nor hair of them since. Seems the battle is hard won. I'll not stop you if you wish to explore, but don't look for my aid if aught goes awry. Yes, of course. We were speaking of places elsewhere. Mayhap tis beyond your ken. But this world of ours is not the real one. This world is a cycle. The dragon emerges, the dragon is slain, and just when we think we have found peace at last, the ditch is endless. Endless and tiresome, wouldn't you say? Yet, such is the lot of those who reside in a false world like ours. The real world is not nearly so stagnant. All manner of things occur there. It is a far more fearsome existence than ours, to be sure. Is there a way to travel to the real world, you ask? <laughs> Must I do all the thinking here? Ponder that yourself. What I will say is that I believe the cycle will continue unbroken for as long as the dragon continues to be slain. You doubt your ears, but I speak truly. I have beheld the real world with my own eyes. I thought you might like this, so I picked it up. Here you go. 